The moon has fallen. The crescent moon. Just two. The half moon. Miss who? The full moon. Vincent. The egg. Bones. The kid in your neighbourhood. Night. The kids were sleeping soundly. Suddenly, Bones was woken by a loud thud coming from outside. She put on her glasses and went out to investigate. She went further and further away from the juju van. into the dark, mysterious forest. In the clearing, she was shocked by the sight of what looked like a fallen crescent moon. Frightened, she ran quickly back to inform her friends. Maybe we can do something to get the moon back into the sky. Bones thought to herself, as she ran towards the juju van. Bones woke Miss Who up. She woke the egg up. The moon has fallen. She woke Vincent up. She chucked Yucky Chew so violently it woke the kid in your neighbourhood up. All the friends dashed to help save the moon. All of them except Miss Who who had gone back to sleep just after she had woken. What a lazy bone! The kid in your neighbourhood turned to look at Miss Who, who was still asleep. As Miss Who was slowly waking up, the friends came closer to the fallen moon. Yes, it was the moon all right, lying on the ground. The children were speechless. Is that the moon? Miss Who asked, fully awake by now. The, the moon has fallen. Poor moon. Let's try to get her up. As Miss Who's hand touched the fallen moon, something strange happened. The, the moon broke into several parts. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. The moon is broken. The moon is broken. 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 Huh? Lift up your heads, pals. Look there. The egg pointed to the sky. The children looked up. The moon had not fallen. The moon was not broken. It was still up there in the sky. What the children had seen earlier was just the reflection of the moon in the water. <laughs>